coming to you live from Cannes. Um, it is the end of day five of the judging process and we only have one day left tomorrow, day six. And last night was a very, very late night and today was a very intense day, but we made great progress and we have an awesome shortlist to share with the media and the rest of the public relations community. So on this video, what I wanted to do is just share with you um, three things. One, I want to give you some stats to help give more context to what CAN is. Secondly, I want to talk to you quickly about creativity. And then finally, I want to talk to you about integrated marketing. So first, some stats. So as I said, we were finalizing the shortlist, really, really important part of this because the medals, the, the trophies, I should, should say, are awarded from the shortlist. So last year, um, um, there were 151 entries on the shortlist, and they gave out um, about 95 lions. I think it was 21 gold, 29 silver, 45 bronze. This year, because there was almost double the amount of entries, um, we had 224 entries on our shortlist. PR is the fastest growing category at Cannes, so I would expect that this, even next year, that the shortlist will grow to be even more than that. Um, so those are some stats. And then secondly, I want to talk to you about creativity. What was interesting in the jury um, deliberation room today was that because of the internet, it is so easy for people to, you know, Google campaigns, Google brands to see what was done before. In the past, when you were judging, you just didn't know. You took things as, oh, wow, this was really creative. But now, because someone can Google a campaign, they, they can say, well, this was done in Brazil last year. Or they could say, this campaign for this particular cleaning product, this was done in the UK two years ago. This is not very original. And it can. It's all about originality and creativity. So that was really, really interesting. It's almost like there's nothing really new to the world. Or not that there's nothing really new, but it's better be new to the world. Because the crowd at can is tough. And this is all about creativity. And then the third thing I wanted to talk about was integrated marketing. One of the things that's really cool about this process at Cannes is that there's something called privilege voting for the jury members. So that means if an entry falls off of the shortlist and a jury member feels really, really passionately about it, they can bring it back on. Well, that's what happened to us with our integrated marketing category. We looked at the entries. We're like, we're not sure that this is really the best reflection of integrated marketing because for our 2014 jury and for me as the president, this is really important that PR is at the core of the integrated idea and that um, PR leads the integrated effort. So using our privileged votes today, we were able to bring some integrated marketing campaigns back onto the list that we judge, which was just phenomenal. And I'm so excited because I know that in this particular um, short list, there are a lot of PR firms that have have the work on the list. And I know that just from, from knowing who's done the work in the past. Um, so I feel really good that our PR firms are going to do well this year at Cannes, and, and who knows, maybe the Grand Prix winner will be from a PR firm. So um, with that being said, I'm going to go to dinner, and I will talk to you tomorrow, but have a great night, and um, look forward to sharing with you more about who actually wins.